Hello everyone, today I'm going to talk about uh, having an escape plan. When you move overseas, uh, the best thing to do is if you're moving overseas just to get a job or try to live, you always, like I said in a previous episode, you need to have money to last for one year and you need to have money when you return to your home country. Some people don't do this. So having an escape plan is the best thing to do. You need to make sure that you have a plane ticket to get out of the country at a moment's notice. You never know when things will go from bad to worse. You lose your job, your money's running out, uh, you have problems with your significant other who's now going to go and cause you serious problems. So you need to have an escape plan and basically an escape plan is the way to buy a plane ticket. You do not know how many people get stranded in countries because they have no money to leave that country. They don't have a plane ticket. I've seen teenagers come to Thailand, 19, 20 years old, uh, 25 year olds and less, and they wind up spending all their money on alcohol and drugs and partying and then discover, I have no money to live another 30 days. Some people actually wind up selling their passports. Some cash in their plane tickets. The next thing you know, they're out of money. They have nowhere to go. They have nothing to do. And so that winds up that they end up uh, stranded, homeless, begging on the street. There was one girl I saw a video of. She didn't even have taxi money to get to the airport. And she was begging. She was going to walk 20 something miles to the airport because she had no money. Do not put yourself in that situation. Always have a plan to leave a country and be able to get back and get yourself back on your feet within three, four days. So make sure that you have at least two, three thousand dollars left in your account, a roof over your head, and food on the table. Now the two or three thousand will be just for money to feed yourself, pay rent, or whatever else other expenses you have. You do not want to get back to your home country and be homeless or have to move in with your parents because you have no money. So basically, before you leave, make sure you know that you are not going to touch a certain amount of money. You have a daily budget and then you know that if things go bad to worse, you are going to leave with no problems. You do not want to leave or live in a country where you have nothing and you cannot leave or things come so bad that you are living hand to mouth. You do not want to be that way in any shape, manner, or form. All right, so that's going to do it for me now. Okay, thank you.